Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to another Google Calendar API in Python tutorial. My name is Jay. From the last video, we learned how to create a Google Calendar service instance. In this video, we're going to learn how to take that service instance to create and delete a calendar. Right, so here let me go to the documentation. And I'll be using the calendars resource and the insert method and the delete method to uh, create and delete a calendar. And let me go to my calendar app. Right, so on the left hand side is my uh, calendar list. Here, let me make the fonts a little bit bigger. So currently in my account, I have uh, four calendar lists. And some of the calendars are default calendars, such as uh, my own calendar, birthdays, remainders, and tasks. If I want to create a brand new calendar, here let me go back to the documentation. And if we look at the insert method, this method only has one required uh, parameter for the request body, and which is summary. And summary is the title of your calendar. So to create a calendar, it's pretty easy. Here, let me go to my uh, my script. I'm going to uh, grab uh, this code block. I'm just going to copy and paste. So here I'm going to create my a request body object and it's going to be a dictionary and there's only one parameter, it's called summary and this is going to be my uh, calendar title and let's say I want to create a calendar uh, for things happening in San Francisco so I can name this calendar San Francisco events Now to create the calendar I'll insert my service object dot calendars dot insert And for the body parameter, I'll provide my request body object that execute. And here let me save the output to, a, to an object code response and print. All right, so if I run this script, and if we look at the response from the response object, so we'll get the calendar type, uh, e tag. The calendar ID, the calendar name, and the calendar time zone, which is uh, UTC time zone, and these are some of the uh, additional information. Now let me go to my calendar app. Now if I refresh the page, and here's my San Francisco event calendar. If I want to delete that calendar, here, let me go back to the documentation. Then I'll go to the DD method. And if we look at the DD method, we just need to provide the calendar ID. So here, let me grab the parameter. And here, let me make a note to create a calendar. To delete a calendar. To delete a calendar. I'll insert my service object again, dot calendars, dot delete. I'm going to insert the parameter name, calendar ID. And here, let me just merely copy the calendar ID, which is going to be this ID value, dot execute. I'm going to uh, come out these two lines. I'm going to run the script. Now if I go back to my calendar app and refresh, and the San Francisco event calendar is now deleted. All right, so this is everything I want to share in this video. Hopefully you guys found the video useful. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.